I got my work clothes on. It's time to do the backsplash. It's day 139. Hey guys, I got my cereal here. That is the uh, Protein Plus and the Great Grains and Skim Milk. And it is 10 after 9. Got up late today. Planned on being started by now. <laughs> the dog is playing with a piece of food like it's a bug or something. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to eat this, drink some water, then drink a Coke Zero, uh, and get started. Got it. Hey! Hey, looking good. Thanks, me or the tile? You, of course. <laughs> and I, the and tiles I are looking great. I have a boo boo. I had a boo boo, but uh -oh. my daddy put a band aid on it. I did, I know. I remember, I just did that. <laughs> and uh, I was. Really How long have I been doing this now? And I've only got this much done. Um, probably. Well, you gotta remember that you you you'd never done this, and you kind of made that one mistake, and then you you know. So what let's probably. Did I, what mistake did I make? But you were trying to butter the back of the the Can first I one. Uh -huh. Don't grab my hand like that, Madison. I'm trying to take a video. Anyway, I think I it's coming along. I back buttered one of these mesh pieces, and it came all the way through the grout lines in the front, and then I tried to wash it off, and. It uh, just made a mess. So I had to throw that whole piece away and uh, get another piece. And I really can't do the back buttering yet. Either I don't have the, the skill or expertise or um, it's just not going to happen. So eating lunch. Got a turkey sandwich and one serving of the Lay's potato chips. And there's the backsplash so far. You still have to do cuts over here and then put that side on. And then I have to do cuts all the way on the top and then on the bottom down here and on the top. I know it's kind of crazy how that turned out, but I had to have it even on the main counter surface. And then um, I'm almost done over here. Okay, it is 3.37. We were going to run out and go get Madison a new swimsuit because we can't find hers and it was too small anyway because she has swim class in less than an hour, but now it's raining outside and it might be canceled and we're not quite sure. And Alana just got up from her nap and I have had surprisingly great energy today. Um, I don't mean like energy level as far as up, able to do stuff, lots of energy like that. I mean like a good energy, like um, just in a good mood and... Um, stuff like that. Madison's a little upset right now because it's raining outside and she's afraid that her swim class is going to be canceled because it's in an outdoor pool. Um, I've just had some quiet time catching up on some things that I needed to do for school and for military stuff. Um, and it's coming down right now. So I don't know if we're going to get out of here to go get a swimsuit right now or not. I guess we're just going to have to see what happens. Okay, so it is 20 after 4. We are out of Walmart, and I've already uh, talked to the Y, and they did reschedule the swimming class uh, today, although the sun is shining now. Um, whatever. So that's rescheduled for Friday. She has another class on Wednesday. Hopefully she'll be able to make it to. I, it was kind of a uh, not-so-smart decision on my part to schedule the swimming class at this time of day during this time of year as I was just telling Madison because it rains a lot here <laughs> this time of day. Um, so next time we will be scheduling it earlier in the day. Um, anyway, Madison got a new swimsuit. It's got... Here, Madison, why don't you show us what it has on it.
Let's see it. Okay. I'll just look at it and tell you. Okay, well let us see it. Show it to the camera. Uh, it's something new. It's a girl and then Princess and the Frog. Princess and the Frog. What's her name? I can't remember. Princess Tiana. Princess Tiana. Yeah. Mama tried to convince you to get a different one with with different the different princesses on it and uh what was the other one? The one that's old. With a rainbow on it, but you wanted that one. And it doesn't have crisscrosses in the back, thank God, so she can get it on by herself. If your kids aren't old enough yet, if your if your daughters aren't old enough yet to wear a swimsuit or to put one on themselves, I would recommend you get one with no crisscrosses in the back because they will not be able to put it on themselves. These ones are much easier. Anyway, um, so to pacify Madison, who was two millimeters away from having a meltdown, I've decided to take them to Cece's Pizza for dinner. Uh, which means that it will be a mini indulgence day for myself. And because I am in such a super mood today, I'm not letting it get me down. I'm not letting it bother me at all. I'm not going to feel bad about it. Um, maybe I should, but I'm not going to. Uh, we're going to have a nice, relaxing meal. Um, partially to pacify her and partially because the kitchen is disaster area and I don't really have room to cook anything and uh, so whatever. Life happens. You know I was just thinking like about this whole indulgence day thing and kind of back and forth and all that kind of stuff. It's like I tried for two years to lose this weight after Alana was born and I would get on the wagon I'd fall off and I'd stay off and I never really made any progress but I know that this time is different and I can't really explain how I know stop it you two but I just know because I know that I can fall off the wagon or I can have an indulgence day or a cheat day or I can overeat one day and it doesn't mean that I'm then gonna overeat except that I'm going to eat over and over and over and over every day after that. You know what I'm saying? Because um, I know that I'm going to lose this weight. I know I'm going to get down to my goal weight. I know that I may be eating too many calories today, but that doesn't mean that I'm going to eat too many calories tomorrow. And even if I do eat too many calories tomorrow, it doesn't mean I'm going to eat too many calories the next day. I know that eventually I will get there. Um, it's just a different mindset. It's just a different, it's just different this time. Well, that turned into a full-fledged indulgence day. It is what it is. You can't set a food addict in the middle of a buffet and expect them to behave themselves. Whew. Just sat down. I am tired. I am really tired. I'm highly motivated to do more work tonight, but my body's saying no. <sighs> it's quarter to eight. Um, I haven't sat down. I haven't sat. In, I haven't sat down since we got back from Cece's. Um, I've been working in the kitchen, cleaning up, and uh, measuring my cuts for the rest of the backsplash. And Lowe's told me that if I make my marks my measurements that uh, they will cut it for me so I won't have to rent a tile saw from Home Depot or whatever uh, so that's cool so I got lots of my measurements made and my uh, my marks made on some of the tile but I still have a whole bunch more to do I will at least get that done tonight um, so that I can take them over there uh, hopefully in the morning, uh, the tiles, and then get them cut, and then maybe I might even have enough time to get them put up uh, before Brian goes to work. If not, um, I think I might be able to get it done while the girls are up and around. Um, then I'll have to let that set for 24 hours, 
then um, put the sealant on and let that sit for I think 24 hours and then put the grout on and then um, the caulk around the outside. I don't know I don't know how long I have to let the grout sit before I can do that and then in two weeks because we have to let the grout cure for two weeks um, after that I can put this semi-gloss sealant on them to make them a little bit more light reflective a little bit a little bit shiny um, I'm excited to see it all done I'm like really loving it oh my goodness Daisy's playful and Solon is not in the mood so Alana's already down Madison's watching TV for five more minutes um, we've decided that we're just gonna paint that back wall the same colors we're painting the rest of the kitchen for now uh, if we decide something later then we'll do it later but for now we're just gonna paint it the same warmer beige that we're gonna paint the rest I'm gonna paint the rest so still a bunch of projects going on in the kitchen if you guys aren't interested in that I'm so sorry to bore you <laughs> um, but that's what's going on in my life right now so that's what I'm vlogging uh, just been drinking water since we got home. I don't know what, if anything, I'll eat for the rest of the night. Um, still pretty full. And I won't even get into what I ate, but it was way more than I should have eaten. And I ate at least like three cinnamon rolls or whatever. Uh, I do feel like I overdid it. I don't necessarily feel guilty. I just feel like... Is it possible to not feel guilty if you felt like you made a mistake? I don't know. Because I do feel like I made a mistake. But... Whatever. I'm not real torn up about it or anything. I just... Uh, I have to get better at having more self-control. You know, I should be able to go to a very inexpensive buffet and not feel obligated, or I didn't even feel obligated, but not even just feel like it's a free-for-all, like, go crazy. I should have had a game plan. I should have said, okay, I'm going to have a salad and one breadstick, and then I'm going to have two pieces of pizza and one cinnamon roll. That would have been, in my mind, acceptable um, but yeah I ate more than that probably about double or triple that um, so yeah that's something to work on I have to work on that and yep 